yeah, we're here to try and beat the longest Round Rover possession. I was actually on the event with uh, a 110 Defender in 2004 when we set the record of 260 Land Rovers. That was just outside Tulsa Racecourse on the A45, I think. And uh, we got it then. Since then, the Dutch have tried with over a thousand vehicles and they failed. The South Africans tried with over 700 vehicles and they failed. And today, we now have hopefully 357 Land Rovers that are going to try and break the world record again today. And our all intentions of hoping we're going to do that. Have a chat with them just to make sure they let her through. Yeah, okay, I'm not I'll, sure I'll go driving. and have a hmm? I'm not sure if she's driving. No, I'm not either. Um, but I'll, I'll have a mention that, that uh, it should be coming down. It should be coming down, yeah. And then we can just get them all lined up here nice and smooth yeah. too, that we can just go. Could you explain to them why we're all here? We're here to uh, support and raise money for the. Uh, Heroes that's fighting the, uh, the war in uh, Afghanistan and all around the world, wherever British troops are. Yeah. So we're here to support them, the injured ones that come back and don't get enough support from the government, yeah. basically. <laughs> What do you feel about or think about the people who are actually doing this, or the armed forces, the civilians that are raising money? What, what do you personally think about it? Personally, I think it's a good thing to do. People are obviously raising money, raising awareness for us as well. Yeah. I'm quite happy with that. Yeah. It means that obviously we're not just out there doing nothing. Yeah. For no reason, no one, everyone here actually cares and actually raising money for us and no. our injured lads. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Uh, we're, lucky, uh, we're local, we're from Staffordshire Works from West Midlands, uh, based in Coventry, this ambulance. Um, and we're here just to represent the Red Cross at the event, but also just to join in because we're both all Land Rover enthusiasts, so it's good to, to come along and bring a couple of our vehicles along with us. It's, uh, yeah, it's been good. We came yesterday and uh, we had a stall yesterday, and then today we've got the two vehicles obviously, so it's uh, working well. What are you going to say? Huh? Hello. Hello. Yeah. What car are you in? He's a lunch. Can you tell me why you're here today? Yeah, yeah, we're here to uh, obviously support the forces. Uh, you know, I believe they get a raw deal and always under-resourced, current climate and everything, but, you know, above all, we're Land Rover fanatics and uh, we love anything coming together with a Land Rover. Let alone Land Rover as a military together, it's brilliant. Couldn't beat it. Excellent. This is our 110 Defender that we done the added attempts at the world record in 2006 and this was first teddy bears picnic. We had 
296 teddy bears on the Land Rover then. And this Discovery 3, we're doing it in this year, is Teddy Bears Picnic 2, and we have 33 teddy bears in and on this vehicle. We joined the uh, convoy at uh, Woodhead Services. We just tag tagged along with them, like. So uh, it's been good fun. Good fun coming down in a convoy on the motorway, yeah. and getting a lot of people slowing down to look, to look around me. Okay, um, this is the end of the attempt for the Guinness Book of um, World Records for the longest convoy uh, for Land Rovers. All right. um, behind me are two cameras, which are verification cameras, which have been recording both sides of the lane of traffic in lane one on uh, GDEC in uh, Land Rovers plant at Gaydon, okay, the test track, uh, products testing and proving ground. Um, now what we have to do is switch the cameras off and um, get them over to the Guinness World Records to see if they'll agree to uh, allow the record. Um, camera A and camera B as you can see down there, uh, one next to the car and then one on the other side near the bollards. All right, I'm now going to go and switch them off.